out, you guys. I'm really sorry about that. But I didn't want to stream at the time, so um don't really have any updates. Right now I'm just kind of working on some question marks and stuff like that. Nothing like crazy. Not really that close to like where the main. Ooh, I'm gonna fall. Fall damage! It's okay, it's just the ocean. These are um right here the blood moss. It always I always feel like it's um like a splotch of blood. What now? I'm doing some question marks right now, Janelle, and I needed to finish this one quest. Oh, also, one of the quests that I completed, um, um, the option was to kill this dude's son or kill his, like, lover. Because his his lover um, cursed his son. Because his son was from a different marriage. Or from, like, his marriage. Yeah, so... I didn't want to kill the lady, but I didn't want to kill the kid. And so I decided not to kill the lady. So, um, he's like, I, I better never see you again. Yeah, he did not appreciate so who knows what's gonna happen with that well yeah I know that but I mean like I I was screwed Great. 
Greetings, traveler. So, yeah, I did that. Got back your stolen horn, and I uh, killed the thieves. Shame that. They weren't evil men. Didn't give me a choice. Where's my reward? Take it. And next time, slay some damn monsters. Um, I still have to meet Yennefer at the Magic Cataclysm. That's like my next thing I'm gonna go do now. Um, if I can find a close... Close... Jeez. Man, I'm telling you, some of these loading screens in Skellige are forever. I mean, they were forever in the other one, too, but I was just like... There were a couple of, like, things I was just, like, walking through, and there was, like, a whole lot of story. I'm like, any day now, people! I need to sell some stuff. Can you toss Help me I played a bunch of Gwent, too. Would very well be your lucky day. Spending hard-earned coin, that's an art in itself. I did notice there's quite a bit in the water. just made these pants they're witcher gear um, so I need to go and put them in my stash until I'm like ready to to do that stuff with them but I haven't really made it back to my stash yet so I did not know there were feline ones. Hello. Hello. What you doing? I have a picture rendering. Oh. Good. What I did to make the ice not render right the first time. But it looks right now. Awesome. Yep, I did not make a bowl though. Doesn't have enough money. Of course he doesn't. So long. Okay. We serve her. I 
I've seen a lot more bugs too. And a couple of elementals. Used a bunch of bombs. Now I need to... Oh, and these wolves over here, they mean business. Yes, I've seen Cyclops over here as well. Of course, since I've been using oil a lot, it's like been no problem for me to kill stuff. Bunch of secondary quests. I did the, this one. Where's the other one? I uh, already completed the one with um, where I was in jail. So I went through this dream cave, which was crazy. This one, Cave of Dreams. So that was done. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. The blade one. So that's about it. Jesus, 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 Jesus. No, 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 no. Oh my god, what the actual fuck is that? Um, he's really big. Yeah, he has... Scared... Uh, no, 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 I haven't. Show me what you got. Oh, man, he got me. Does he heal too? What now? Jeez, oh. he's just that hard. I know. Yeah, I was just trying not to have that happen. Shit, shit. 
it. Giving up though, you know. Not done with you. Did I get to loot you? I guess so. I guess he is done with me because he is not here. Go! save either. How long is your rendering going to take? It said 26 minutes, so let me go check on it. It's not been 26 minutes. No, I know. Looks like it might be done. Oh. Yep. How's it look? You want to see it? Just go me in her. Mm -hmm. 
Seems like in the forest there's like a lot of those bugs. on the other side of the island. Good! May all Skellige know Jennifer of Vengerberg is a common thief! Control yourself, Druid. I haven't stolen anything. I've merely borrowed something and fully intend to return it. Ha! The generosity. Just one small problem. Once used, the mask is rendered completely worthless. Not to mention the risk you'll bury us alive. And all the Isles with us! Barry, what are you talking about? She's not told you? Might have expected as much. The myth is that Urborus created the mask when the envious sea swallowed his beloved. Unable to bear the prospect that he would never again see his betrothed, Urborus made the mask which would allow him to peer into the past. He knew, however, that he could only use it once. So he waited. Waited until his longing grew so strong that it became unbearable. When the sea learnt of the mask, it was quick to respond. It made known its threat that whosoever used the mask would bring the sea's wrath down on them. For in vengeance, the sea would rise and flood all the lands and drown the living. Where do you get this mask? Sailors from Clan Dimmon pulled it from the sea, near the Nyor Trench. Yeah, but how can you be sure this is Urboros' mask? Its appearance is exactly as described in the myths. You believe the myths? Only ignorant fools belittle their significance. Besides, it's not the myths that are on trial here. It's the thief. So I'm trying to see if I can be noisy and no increase the life. Croc gave us free reign. See how it turns out. First off, this might indeed be his isle. But we, the druids, watch the no alien magic taste hold here. Secondly, after the cataclysm occurred, Krach turned to us for help and trusted this site to our care. Third! Oh, God. What was that? No. Jennifer's used the mask. Well, it's a little late now. Okay, I know I need to talk to her. But this question mark is too close by for me not to go get it. Totally have a spot open. I like this one. Notice I didn't have many of these guys. Man, I'm not sure.
damages and slows enemies within a 10 yard radius. Mm. Ooh, this one's really good. I feel like I could switch this one out for my other one. Like, that's good, but this is also really good. Oh, and this one's really good, too. I'm gonna have to think about it. Alright. Where you at, Yennefer? that unicorns damn it yana i saw the foglets i meant how they get here the power of the mask summoned them ermian says the mask might cause a natural disaster fortunate he's here then he can jump right in try to tame it yep realize he won't let this pass oh i'll survive somehow what now the mask reveals the past but only in certain places. Places where past events left a strong magical imprint. Take it. Want me to wear okay. it? Yes. I'll cast a spell that will let me see through your eyes. Gonna read my mind again? You object? You do it whenever you want anyway. No harm in it then, is there? Let's go. Already found the first spot. Is it? Oh, there it is. Instructions? Keep it on until you've seen everything. And don't stray far until everything is limited in range. What's that? A portal? Two people emerged from it. The woman was Siri. How can you know? The way she moved. Like a witcher. Seems they went that way. Come, let's find the next spot. Watch out! 
What was that? Hmm. A magic explosion of some sort. So powerful that even the Echo was dangerous. I wager it destroyed the forest. But Siri and her companion weren't harmed. I saw them escape. Let's see where to. The place is creepy. I don't like it. Anyone here when this has had a slim chance of survival. I know what you're thinking, but don't worry. So you can take care of this. Well, ready? Magic residue trail leads to Vela. Any chance you can figure out where Ciri's companion fled to? His portal's gotta be nearby. I'll try to find it. Come. It's Ciri's companion and the one who wounded her. How do you know? I don't. Making an educated guess. They both appeared in the previous visions. Ciri's got a powerful ally. Maybe something left of the one who got hit by the spell. It's clearing up. Ermion must be getting a handle on the weather. Which means he'll be free to attack us again. Are you pleased yeah. with yourselves? Look at what you've brought down on us! We'll see what Krach has to say about this. Relax. Storm's died down. You've clearly got things under control. For now! But who knows what would be a week or two on? Stop panicking! Here's your mask. It is worthless. It's an unwieldy ashtray at best. I hope you've learned something useful at least. Very. I'm talking to Geralt. You! You I'll deal with later. So... Got a feeling we found something interesting. Thank Just you. need to examine one more thing. Something's pinned under that tree. Can you... I can. Armor's clean. No blood, no sword mix. Ciri's friend must have... What do you call it? Vapor. Is it here? Exquisite. The armor. All the workmanship's unfamiliar. Can't even tell where it's from. Probably because it belonged to a writer of the Wild Hunt. What? Oh, no! So it's true? The Wild Hunt? I feared as much. First here, then on Hindersfjall. What did they want? They're looking for Ciri. But... why? It's a long story that involves the Elder Blood and Ciri's abilities. Did she, perchance, inherit her mother's skills? Ciri can do much more than her mother could. But right now we're much more interested in what the Wild Hunt was doing on Hindusfjall. Well, it happened at least a fortnight after the Cataclysm struck here on Art Skellig. The raids raided Lofoten at dusk in a blizzard. Itself a strange occurrence for that time of year. The islanders sent the wraiths. They barged into their huts, killed anyone who resisted, then galloped inland, laughing fiendishly. Anyone survive? A dozen or so women and an old man. Next stop, Hindersfjall. I'll meet you on the beach near Lofoten. Mm -hmm. See you there.
Good luck See to ya. you. Inform me once you've learned anything new. Thank you, White One. You're not one of us, but you sure fight like an islander. How's it you came to Skellige? Long story. Got something to take care of here. As we all do. Me, for instance. I'm looking for my sister. What happened to her? Oh. Pirates took her. But I'll get them in me grip and squeeze. Regret their mothers ever bore them as they shit themselves. Nowhere to go. Got any clues? These two here before they pounced on me, said their captain had set sail for Hindersfjall. Carisu were on board his longboat. Hope you find her. Listen, yeah. if you come across those pirates or see Carisu anywhere, tell her to go to Blandair. Tell her to go home. Got my word on that. Sure, if I well. remember. Any question marks on the way? We can go to this one first.
right, Carol, let's get it together. We're getting, we're, we're moving up. view of the ice on the camera? Yeah, these bastards are beating the hell out of me. I guess they gave up. I really wanted to go over there, but those guys. Yeah. Yeah. So I was tweaking the camera? Yeah. While it was windbreaking? Right, right. It stopped. I didn't know I was going to do that. Oh, man. So I'm rendering it from a different angle now, just to see what it's going to look like. I'm trying not to sink the boat, but... Can you sink the boat? Oh, yes. The boat can be sunk. See that I've got two quadrants right there mm -hmm. that are not good? Yep. It's because of these bastards. Don't rock the boat. Ugh. Come on.
can't wait for that one. He's B star. Don't be like Skyrim. I know it's raining. Maybe our ship will not, you know, completely fall apart before we get there. forever. And this weather. Trying to do some zigzagging. I think it's helping.
Is my boat done? You just can't drive through the dragon or the siren. No? The boat's like, don't go that way, bro. That's how I die. It literally... Fine. Fine, keep this stupid boat. Go attack them head on. Wonder if anyone survived. Looks like rain. Priestess is afraid I would attend to any survivors. The only ones around here with any notion about medical care. swim there because my boat gave up on me. Not that far, so it's okay. Good thing you're here. The frostbite was starting to set in. You should have dressed warmer. <laughs> Next you'll be pinning mittens to my coat. Can we go? Yeah. Quite a few years since I was last on Hindisfjall. But if I remember correctly, Lofton should be this way. Raised huts and fresh graves. Mm, this must be it. 
Gathering of some at a bad time. Hello, it's no Luffy. good time to talk about the wild hunt. Ritual of some kind. We'll have to wait. We'll do no such thing. Dear sisters, pardon the interruption, but we've an important matter to discuss. Can you not see we're commemorating the dead? So. And we're looking for someone who's still alive. Please, this is urgent. <sighs> then speak. We're looking for a young woman, name of Siri. Ashen hair, green eyes. I'm sorry. She is not here. Unless she lies in a grave. That is, I do not recall one by that name. But I buried so many. I may have forgotten. This... this Siri. Has she a scar here on her cheek? Yes. Yes, what happened to her? I don't know. Saw her but for a moment. Right before... before it all. She was in the stables. Craven. A thousand curses upon him. This Craven you mention, does he have a name? He did. Until the elders struck him from the saga of ancestors. It's as if he has ceased to exist. The lore forbids anyone from touching him, speaking to him, even uttering his name. What did he do to deserve that? He fled from the wild hunt. He alone. We need to talk to oh. him. Even if it's not in keeping with your customs. You've come too late. He went to the garden to fight Morkvar. Morkvarg? What's that? Who, you mean? The vilest man ever to inhabit Skelliger. Nothing was ever sacred to him. He attacked his own clan's lands, took gold from Nilfgaard, killed children, pregnant women. Mm -hmm. Know the type. They said he feared only one thing, the wrath of the gods. Morkvarg sought to prove how wrong they were, so he sailed to Hindisfjall to ransack the goddess's garden. This was over a decade ago. Archpriestess Ulva stood in his way. He thrust a blade between her ribs and cast her down in the mud. As her lifeblood left her, she cursed him, and Morkvarg transformed into a beast. Interesting. Monster. You've got some work to do. I can get rid of Morkvark. Don't know what he's turned into, but a silver sword should do the trick. It's not that simple. There have been those who have bested Morkvark, yet he always returns. So, it's a complex curse. Meaning I need more information. I understand. But I've told you all I know. Speak with Toradar's son, Einar. He was in the garden when Morkvarg and his men attacked. He saw what happened. Of all the pilgrims there at the time, he alone escaped with his life. He settled in Larvik. You'll find him there at the landing, provided he's not out to sea when you arrive. Where is this holy garden? Not far from here. North. We cultivated healing herbs there once. And now? Now we walk only as far as the tree the goddess planted. We place our offerings and make our pleas before it. Those who venture below remain in the garden forever. Thanks for your help. I understand right. you intend to enter the garden. Yes. I dislike it when foreigners enter the sacred grounds. But so be it. We'll Custom demands pilgrims right? make an offering of their own blood before the tree. Craven surely did so. Unless he lacked not only courage, but respect for Freyr as well. You needn't worry about us. Geralt and I always give the gods the respect they are due. Mm. Worried this trail might have gone cold. Even if Craven's dead. We'll manage. How exactly? You'll see when the time comes. You could stand to be nicer sometimes. I suppose. But then I wouldn't be the woman you fell in love with, would I? Hello. 
My mind. That must be more common. A bite. Just one morsel. One piece. A crumb. Uh, food. Food. Uh. <coughs> Shank. Not, not again. Not again. <laughs> He doesn't seem happy to see us. Wait till he gets a closer look at me. So, where shall we start? Let's go to that tree the sisters mentioned. Plan to bleed yourself for the goddess? Not necessarily, but Craven did. We just might pick up his scent. Craven was here. Look, the impression. Kneeled down on one knee. Cut himself to make the offering. Bloodstains, see them? No. I may be inhumanly beautiful, but I don't have superhuman senses. Not like you. Which is why you should stay up here. No offense, but in that undergrowth and mud, you'd be like a... Ball and chain? <laughs> Planned to say it gentler, but yeah, that's basically what I had in mind. Fine. We'll do as you say. If the need arises, I can cast spells from up here. Fine. See you later then. Don't get hurt. Remember, I need you if I'm to find Siri. Oh, come. I was just teasing. Fool. I need you. Period. Better? Mm -hmm. Better. Mm-hmm. Craven's blood, flowing profusely, trails clear, should lead me to him. Something down there. Can't see a thing. How do you like that silver? Victims. Strange. Is it Craven? No, this one's been here a while. What? I can't hear you. If you want to chat, come closer. Her senses are really dull. <laughs> tracks running chasing something that. Gotta go down, provided I can open the sluice. Mechanism looks pretty standard. One lever to choose the sluice gate, the other to work it.
broke through this door. Must have smelled something beyond it. Symbol of Freya. Starting to envy you. Wish to hear a story. If I have to, I'm all ears. Warriors came. They knew they could not kill me. So they laid a trap. Chained me down. Lock me in here. Know what I did? I bit my leg off to free myself. Every bite brought pain. And Is that that same? I vomited blood. He's cursed. One from way earlier. I am off your own limbs hurts. Who would have thunk? From way earlier? You don't understand. I remember whenever this Janelle did this one. I just don't remember what she did. My mouth burned like swallowing fire. If all inside me was torn, felt I would die. But I, I did it. And then I shredded them, dashed them to bits, made tiny crumbs. Uh, on those flowing heroes act. Your story have a point. We're just doing some chest pounding. <laughs> the moral is you cannot kill me. You cannot stop me. I'll not be bound. Break any fetters. The curse. Free me, or I'll return to get you again. The curse uh, makes me bite, uh, scratch, mangle, uh, till I drop. Uh, you've got time before the blood's gone from me, and, and I return. Listen uh, uh, carefully. Uh, undo, undo the curse. Uh, free me. Uh, finally, I will, I will reward you. Mentioned a reward of some kind. Looted. <laughs> Raided, drunk most away, all but one. Uh, True treasure uh, hid away yours. Uh, just uh, help me. Uh, uh. Looking for a man named Craven. Apparently came here to kill you. Seems it didn't work out. Uh, Those who come rarely introduce themselves. What 
that he look like? Uh, no idea. Then I cannot help you. Uh, I've shredded our uh, belly. Uh, uh. So, no joy in being a werewolf? Nay. It's the worst, not the garden to which I'm bound, even, but the hunger, anything I devour turns to ash, ash I cannot eat, I cannot drink, yet I bloody live and roam and prowl. The hunger is terrible, ah, terrible. I bite my own flesh, but the smallest morsel burns my throat like boiling tar. Everlasting hunger. Classic as curses go. Goes to explain why all those corpses went untouched. Help! Or I'll return to shred you! Rip your limb from limb! See what I can do. See and do, or I shall return. Tiresome conversation, not interested. What will you do? Uh, I'm just, you know, I just want to see if this will do anything. been for a while. Yen, found him. And? And I've seen rot fiends in better condition than this. Shit. Fine, scrape together what you can and haul the bits up here. Take it you've got a plan? No, I just like to stare at rotting flesh. We'll talk when you get here, all right? That's Yen, yeah, okay. charming as ever. Come on, someone wants to meet you. Faction set in, but the vocal cords are intact. We might still get something out of him. 
Doesn't look like the talkative type. Anyone can be made to talk. Even a corpse. One must simply know how. Thought necromancy was strictly forbidden. So is premarital sex. No. But I'm not about to be bothered by such foolishness. Black magic's no joke. Casting those spells never ends well. Never. I don't like it any more than you do, believe me. But the thought that Siri is in danger? I like that even less. I understand. Still doesn't give us the right to... Geralt, please. <clears throat> this is not the time to debate ethics. Need any ingredients for the... Newborn, a Can you grab the these iron. stuff out of the freezer? Mind trying again without the sarcasm? I don't need a thing. I'm a I, yes, I do. I may stop this. All I need is energy. A great deal. Because it's already. We're very lucky. This eleven. It's also considered sacred. Priestesses will be furious if you use the garden's power to revive a corpse. Geralt, you're getting on my nerves. I offer you solutions, you try to poke holes in them. Just give me a second to finish all this conversation. Sorry to bother you with my doubts. Please, Geralt. That's just it. Your please is never a request, only ever a command. But let's move on. Let's get to work. Bring it to you. No, just give me a sec. Selene, Selene, Defrain. Selene, Selene, Davidar. So now we're going to see Siri. Dead rock. You're awake. And I thought you'd... 
Where am I? And who are you? It's all right. You're on Hindersfjall, village of Lofoten. They call me Skjall. But how'd I... What? We fished you out of the sea. Me and that friend of yours. And where is he? My friend. Stepped out a while ago. Said he needed to find a boat. Why does he wear that mask? Something not right with his mug? No. He simply doesn't like others to see it. Help... Help me stand. I... I don't... I don't think you should... Less talk, more giving me a hand. Ah, that's me brother for you. Out of sight for a second, and he's already put his paws on a girl. Astrid, you're as dim as dishwater. You know perfectly well I'm helping her up. It's a shame, I know, but I've got to interrupt your courtship. Come, we're off to the sauna. What? Why is your mouth agape like you're noodling for an eel? The sauna. Girl, you was blue as a whale when we brought you in here. Your blood needs thawing. I'm sorry, but I must get to Drowned Dead Rock as fast as possible. I shan't force you to stay, but the rocks are ways off and you can barely walk. You best take a horse. True. Skjall can prepare a horse for you. You'll have to wait a spell, but even so, you'll get there faster than on foot. Fine, that'll do. Thank you both very much. Pish posh, there's no need. Now come, we gotta sweat the sick out of you. Where are my clothes? I've taken them already. Come on! That man in the mask. Hey! From afar. I've already posted one, but I'm re uh, rendering it again. How come? I adjusted the light. Alright, Janelle, and anybody else that's watching, I'm done for tonight. See you tomorrow!